Okay, good morning everyone. Let me know that you can hear me. Uh, we have a lot to do here today for once in our lives. Oh, look at this market. Ay, 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 ay. I didn't even look at this for like the last hour. Okay, let's just review here very quickly. Yesterday, I knew the market would hold. It, it, it held. It held late in the day, but it still held. Nothing bearish yesterday whatsoever. Again, you know, you got you got another right way to look at this. We'll talk about it later. Market even gapped down this morning, and it has 150% completely flipped. 360% uh, completely all the way around, and we'll go over yesterday's high. Market can make a new high today. I'm still calling it to do it in the, before the end of the month, and really... Depending on the strength that comes in here, the buying that comes in, it could happen today. I don't know exactly if it happens today, but I'll tell you, if it doesn't happen today, it's probably going to happen tomorrow. What is today, Wednesday? Oh, gosh, the cues look like they're going to make a new high today, though. But I think the SPY is the driver, so I think the SPY is the driver. Okay, let's go over the gaps. DFS is way too thin, way too spready. Definitely going to get the volume in it today. Will play out. Uh, is is a good gap. Uh, I'm not going to do this out of the gate because the lack of volume. I could I could have this up here. Uh, I'll just put this here. This is the second pick if we put them in order. Uh, the other ones I put for the secondary watches I didn't really do anything with. Uh, this one, oops, this one here again, too thin. Too thin, not moving. It's got like a tick, so I'm not doing anything with this, and this is not a second pick. Cree is the one. This is the one I was talking about. I saw it over the weekend. I knew it would gap down. I had 100% conviction it would gap down. I guess I jinxed myself, though, by saying to myself, basically, that nothing that it did would not not mean it work. Well, Really, it's going to work today, but is this going to be easy? The answer is no. Can we be aggressive? No. If I was a hunter in the wilderness, I would not, you know, have my gun up, cocked and ready and loaded and ready to shoot, like, immediately out of the gate for this. So I have the numbers. I know what this needs to do. This is not an NCOF play by any means, and I'm still going to short it, but we're not going to attack this today. Now, let me just read what I wrote down. If it, this is what I wrote down last night. Actually, it still applies. I just realized I just wrote down the same thing twice. I didn't even read what I wrote last night. If it hits hard and fast, it will fall all day to the dream target. That's number one. The most redeeming quality about Cree today is the fact that it has a massive, massive, massive target in it. It's going to take a while to get going. This is what I wrote now this morning. It's going to take a while to get going if it doesn't break hard and fast early. Same concept as I saw last night. Really basically the same same thing as last night. So the thing is that I don't want to attack this today. Probably what I'm going to do, I might, hmm, well, let's just see how it sets up. I might do half size on the first setup here to get it, but I think you may need two tries. Unless this does something that is unexpected, which is fall off a planet immediately, but I don't think that's going to happen. I think it's going to take a while to get going. Exactly what I wrote down. I think it's going to take a while to get going. And it's going to work. So you'd have to be a little patient today. So you do have size in the first setup. If we get dinged out, we'll retake it. We're going to hold this, though. Because the best thing about this, the most fabulous thing about this, the most wonderful thing about this is actually that it has the potential to go to a massive, massive number. Uh, that's not why I'm doing it, but I'm just telling you that it's real. Any questions? Market's along. I'm not calling it today because we're watching our shorts. DFS is probably going to make a big, massive, spiky, spiky, taily thing, get volume in it, and then drop and break and fall. I'm not going to contend with that today. Cree is actually the easiest thing to play even though it's not setting up ideal. If we have time today, we'll have a discussion when we're done. If not, we're going to have it tomorrow. 
interesting though that I'm really predicting when things are gonna get. I mean, it's just almost like really. I was talking to Surf Dog on the phone yesterday, and he asked me again, "What? I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. I I don't know what I see. I'm not holding anything back. I'm not hiding something from you. I'm telling you, I do not know how I know this." This one here and the other one in Netflix and all the ones that I predicted to gap in the direction I predicted the gap. And some have been corrections, meaning it's they've been corrections. And I don't know what I see, but you shouldn't really worry about it unless you really want to do an option in it. And if you're doing an option in it and it works and you want to do the option, then that's on you for the risk. All we do is the day trains. Any questions? how off my clocks are. Oh, not too bad. Let's see if we get some cooperation here today from something. Okay, so again, if, if this does hit hard, I'm going after it. I, I'm just saying don't anticipate that. I, I might attack it. Well, let's just see here. But but I'm saying don't anticipate that. So you don't don't no one should be taking this until it triggers. They shouldn't do that anyways. I have no idea what the stop's gonna be here though now. All of a sudden, the spread is like a crazy person. Well, let's just see. How off is my clock? Nine twenty-nine. <laughs> Good luck. I, this isn't going to have this kind of spread in here. Just let the volume come into it, which it's not yet. This is not going to have a 20 cent spread. It's like fooling us. It's a fooler. All right, here we go. All right. Okay, let it rally. Let it rally. It's over 34 now. We do have a 10 penny spread. Let it rally. Let it rally. 34.50 now. Just, just let it rally. Where do we go? Here, I'm taking this off. That's the volume coming into that one. Uh, this is fine in a rally, though. This is not fine with the 24 cent spread. So, Okay, let's do 99 by 35. 99 by 35, this is aggressive. Do half size here. 99 by 35. 99 by 35. Three. 
There, take it. 35, get the stop in. This is aggressive. This is aggressive. This is, this is, this is good though. Okay. I hope we get another inch. Hey, I just, I saw that this was here. Here we go. Oh, geez, Louise. Here, you can, if you didn't do it, set, I wish we could get some, this, I'm glad I called that though. Look, man, I just had a feeling. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, here we go. Oh, that was a great call. I hope you got it. Man, that was a great call. Here we go. Here we go. Let this go. It's doing what I wanted to do. It's doing what I wanted it to do. If it, 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 what I wanted, if it falls, here, it's falling. Be in it. You're in it. You're in it. You're in it. You're in it. First target in here is 3328. Oh, Jesus, Louise. It's almost at the first target. Of course, I wish it would have taken more. <gasps> nice in here. Nice. Let's see if we can get it under 33, and then I'm going to actually take half out. Crappers don't bounce in me here. Okay, that is the first target. You stinker. Okay, you can take half out right in there. That's the first target. But I, I, I actually did it. I didn't. I did not. <sighs> that was an aggressive call. I said I wasn't going to attack it today. I don't know. I, I just, just roll with me here. Just do exactly what I do. Here's the bounce back. And the reason I didn't take half out is because, quite frankly, I don't even know if we're going to get another entry. So, you know what I'm saying. And I'm not saying for sure we don't, but I'm just saying we might not. Let me look at the market. I'm hedging my bets here to see that that's not the, all this does on the day two. Really hedging my bets here, <laughs> but it's worth it. Okay, stop on the next entry is going to be 80, and I don't know where the ad's going to be. But the stop's going to be 80. We're going to do 39 by 80. 39 by 80, you can take more. 39 by 80, you can take more. In fact, I'm going to put half the stop for 80 right now. 39 by 80, take more, and I'm going to put half the stop right now over 80. Because I didn't get out of any. Here, here, here. Oh, this, here. This is it. <sighs> Let me just see. Okay, I put half the stop over 80. Half the stop's over 80. Let's make sure that's right. Spread is changing so much. It's insanity. Let's give it 85. Just because of the spread.
Here we go. Man, this is aggressive. I can't I can't talk about anything or to anyone or anything at all. We're not talking. Let it break 33. I'm just trading here, people. I, this is so hard, and I did, I'm did. i doing it so well. <laughs> this is just, 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 and we're not talking. Here we go. Here we go under 33, and I'm taking a half out because it's the right thing to do. Crap, though. 30. Two. No, I gotta, I gotta take a half out there. Just wait, 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 wait. Time of the day in here. Hold on. Gosh, darn it. Stay with it. Stay with it. It's going to break 33. Stay with the trade. Don't you dare back up on me now. Come on. Well, I'm staying with it. I didn't get out of any down there. It didn't break 33, but... Well, let's find out. This is this is wild today though. It, this is not easy. We haven't had an easy day for a hundred years, but I'm doing I'm doing great. That's all I can do. Here, yes, okay. Hand in the button here now. I gotta get out of half of this soon. Here we go. Let it break thirty three. It's gonna it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna it's gonna. I knew it. There, there, here, go, 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 go. This is a nice trade. Let it go, let it drop, let it go, let it go. Here it goes. Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. Next number, next number. Try to stay with it. Try to stay with it to 945. Try to stay with it. This is a nice trade. Oh, my Lanta. There, I just took half out. I just took half out. I had to. I had to. I was up too much. <laughs> All right, hold on. Just hold everything. <sighs> 85. 85 for the rest. <sighs> I'm sorry, Christine. Christine, I didn't even look at anything anybody wrote. That was incredibly hard. I'm just calling things in the wind. Did, did, I hope you all got it. Jaguar Paul, you missed it. I'm, you've got to listen to everything I say. I, I didn't even look at the screen until now. I did not. I did not. Do you have any idea how hard that just was? <laughs> it just fell off a planet. I don't think it matters where you got it. Did you do it, Christine? You made money? You Yeah, you, you couldn't have not made money. Here, it's continuing to go. It's continuing to go, but I think that was the right thing to do to get out of half there. And I'm almost like, I'm almost like having my hand on the button here for the rest. Because really, here, you know what? If this doesn't break 79, I am out of the whole thing. In fact, if it goes over 33, I am taking the whole thing. Ah, time of the day is 940. Oh, but you know it's going to go. Here. No, no, I just took the rest. I just took the rest. I took the rest. It's going to bounce back too much. I'm out of the whole thing. It didn't break the low. It let it reset up again. Just do it. That was too much. It was too much. It was too good of an entry. If you're still in it, that's fine. You're looking for a massive target if you're still in it. I took the whole thing. I think it resets up, though, if it bounces back enough. And it'll be up to you if you redid it. I'm out of the whole thing. <sighs> that. That was a phenomenal entry. And I'm giving myself a round of applause. And that's why you people are here. And you want to complain on the days that I don't want to do crap? We're having a lecture tomorrow. We're not having it today. But I, I this is like, really? And and I told you, you could have done half size, but do it. I ended up doing full size because I saw it do something there. We'll go over it in a minute. But it was like, I can't even tell you how hard this was. I'm all out of it. It'll probably reset up again. If you're still in it, there's nothing you can do but have to stop at 85. <sighs> it's 
gonna try to go again though. This is this is just this is this is this should set up again though. This should set up again. It's gonna run all day now. It did what I said in an ideal world. I, even I'm a little surprised, uh, but here it goes. New low in this. I'm just taking my money and running today though. Under 80, it's a new low. Under 80, it's a new low. And if you're still in any of this, your hand is on the button. But I'm 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 thinking we're gonna get a pushback here. This is an area, and, and that's why I took the whole thing. I, I'm out of the whole thing here. But I'll call it again if you want to redo it. I don't really know if I want to. I, I just made a lot of money there very quickly. Ugh, which is my dream world. <sighs> Boy, do we deserve it. Oh my gosh, it was so hard. New Jersey trader got it. He's all out. You're like buttoned by penny by squeezy penny here. Like literally, it has to keep going here or you will take this whole thing. This is a great call if you did it with me. Like your hand is in the button here. Once this pushes back with the short covering here, it's going to go, woo! And that's what I really didn't want to get caught in. You're taking a chance. But it's going to try. Who's still in any of this? Under 80. It's going to make a new low. Under 80, you could, get, you could get some serious action here, but you could still get a pushback around 60. It didn't break it yet. It didn't do it. I felt it would break 33. Trader Gal still has a third. Anyone else? Anyone else not get it? Jaguar Paul, did you do it or not? You could have just shorted it in the... Oh my gosh, it's going to break the low. Here it goes. Under 80. It's going to do it. I'm out of it. I'm all out of it. No piggies today for me. Beautiful call by me. And I got it so early. But I'm, I'm all out of it. Line 38 Diddy is all out. Discipline Dave is all out. Biker dude's heading out for work rate call. You're welcome. Just, just be prepared for a bounce in here if you still have this, for those of you. I said big massive target today if this goes, but I'm not saying it happens right in here. I wrote all the numbers in the room. What what a great call by me. Ay, 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 ay. I didn't even have planned what we were gonna do. I just called it in the wind. What a great price I got on that. Let me just look. That's why I'm out so much money. It's, it's all about the entry. It's all about it. Oh, market has a little red in it. I'm just saying here now. Hold on one sec. Market is some red. Market is some red in it today. Cree! <laughs> Here, if you're still in it, try to get it through 60. You're, you're watching, like in the next minute though, it's going to bounce. Three red bars here on the, the five-minute chart. This is a beautiful trade though. And let's just see. Well, no, I did have another number written down. Who knows? This is going to go to 32 here now today. I mean, I'm all out. And, and unless it sets up properly, I won't retake it. I'm not sure if that happens. I'm just glad I held it through this part. And here, after this jiggy. Ah, it's going to try to break 60. Let me just figure something out here. Ay, 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 ay. All right, let me just see everyone's questions. Okay. Moonraker is still in it. Okay. With a stop at 3310, that's still very, very far away from here, Moonraker. The, I wouldn't I wouldn't have a stop that far away. If, if that goes over that number, here, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. This is the bounce in here at this time of the day. And I know I said take it 10 pennies ago, but really, like, you're going to get a bounce in here. We'll go over this in a minute. It was 99 by 25 or 99 by 35. Or I don't even know where I told you to put this up. I, I just like, whatever I said, you should have just done it. I don't even remember anymore. <laughs> it was too long ago. Too much has happened since then, 10 minutes before. Money Man's a great call all out. Red's all out. Jax is all out. Discipline Dude says thank you. You're welcome. Beanie's still in it. Why, do you think it's going to zero? <laughs> Geronimo's all out. Trader Gal, you're all out at 85. Good. 
you had to restart your computer two minutes before the open because it was acting weird. By the time you came back, we're ready in the train. Uh, yeah, that's a problem. Shower singer's all out. This is fantastic, though. I'm not in this anymore, and I don't think anyone should be, unless you had decided you were staying in the trade to the dream target. But I will tell you that this is a beautiful call, and wherever, don't worry about it. If you didn't, if you're, if you got out of this where I did, don't even worry about it. And if you're still in this, then you really, you're getting out any second. This is selling. This is institutional selling, and we're watching it live. But, I mean, this is the incredible thing that I can do here, that I saw this would happen here. Like, you do understand how great this is. Like, I saw that that would happen, like, before, that bar wasn't even there when I called the trade. Like, I saw this would happen, like, here. And look at this, look at this. I mean, this is, you know, it's just... <laughs> The gap rated good, but it wasn't exactly what I wanted to see. If it was, I would, if it was an NCOF, I would still be in this, but it wasn't. And so, you know, oh my gosh, look at it. Oh my gosh, look at it. Oh, my Lanta. <laughs> I, I mean, I don't care. I'm, I'm very happy with the money I'm up. But I'm just saying like, ah, look, it's going to get a 32 straight on down. I could have called this again. That would have been ridiculous though. Oh my gosh, look at that. As I'm talking here, it's dropped, just dropped. Look at how, look at the, look. Okay, if it goes to 30, I might cry, but I don't think that's happening. <laughs> I don't think it's happening before it sets up again. I don't, I don't think it's happening before it sets up again. Look, I, I decided I was going to, you know, hold these to the dream targets on NCOFs. It wasn't here, but I saw it. I did see it. I saw it would get down. I saw it would get down, and right now it's doing what I wanted it to do in the gap. Listen, this is very important. Is everyone paying attention to me? You can learn something from this today. Everyone should be up. Everyone should be up and have a beautiful day. Whether you're in this now or got out where I did, it doesn't even matter. Do you understand? It's the fact that I knew to do it. I mean, there's just, I, if I could just, those words cannot describe. Is anyone still in this, though, by the way? If, 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 if you're still in it, it's going to break 32. It's going to break 32 before it bounces down because it's too close. Oh, well, here it goes. Uh, Beanie's still in it. Beanie, you're really getting good, aren't you? All right, Trader Gal now is happy. Trader Gal's in a good mood. Now we can all be in a good mood today. <laughs> you did a bear call spread at $1.52 and it went to 224 I don't know if that paid for the class options help, but it was a good one. You still wanted the Harley? Oh, my Lanta. You people got to learn to have amnesia. And we didn't lose any money in that. We just didn't do it. Surf Dog's all out. Thank you. And Surf Dog did the option. How are you making out with that? Now, this will play out all day. And let me tell you why. This is coming up on everybody's scanner in the planet. Now, Cree is somewhere in here, wherever it is. This will come up on everybody's scanner today because of the move it just had. And, you know, this is pure skill to even do this in here today that we did. But a lot of traders didn't get any of this. I mean, if you hadn't taken it here, look, it just fall off the planet. It did exactly what I wanted it to do in, a, in an ideal world. Let's just read what I said. If it hits hard and fast, it will fall all day to the dream target. So this actually has the potential to get today to 30 or 31. This will come up on everyone's scanner now. Traders didn't do what we did. No one does what I do. No one, no one trades like me. But this will come up on everyone's scanner, and this will get shorted now all day. So you can retake this. Traders will want a short cream out today. So it could get to 31 or 30. 30.65. Now, I did say it's going to take a while to get going, probably, and if it doesn't break hard, I, this is what I said. It's going to take a while to get going if it doesn't break hard and fast. It did break hard and fast, but we took it right in here. Wow, what did I say there?
This was so aggressive. I can't tell you how aggressive this was. I don't even know what I saw now. I'm looking back at it because the numbers really don't match up. I, I don't I don't I don't I don't know how I just did that, but I'm glad we did. I I I I don't know what I just saw there. Now looking at it, I, the numbers didn't really match up, but but it worked. I I just knew it would work. I just felt it would work, but I really wasn't planning on being that aggressive. But I saw it in the live time, and we did. I must have seen something that when it was trading live that made me do it, or I wouldn't have called it. I wouldn't have pressed the button. I don't I don't remember now, and it's flat. You hope this is a welcome to earnings season, yes. Made a little money on the options, you should have held them. You would have made more. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Out, flat, and done. Going back to Ben. Congratulations. <laughs> Surf Talk said Trader Gal must have been PMS yesterday. <laughs> That's funny. Surf Dog. You people are really hysterical. And by the way, thank you for all the nice emails from everyone yesterday. Literally, you people are the best. Who has people nicer than you? No one. I uh, really. So I appreciate it. I, I I didn't have time to write anyone back, and I just got so many nice emails. I want to know how much you people are appreciated. Truly. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go over. I want to talk about hog tomorrow. Not today. Today, I want to talk about pre, and I want to talk about the market. Ew, this was ugly. I'm glad we didn't do this. Let me just see if there's anything else to do. This you could have done. Mm, I don't think I would have done that. Let me just look at the other one. No, this flipped. Well, this one worked. This one worked. It had no volume, and it did kind of get the volume right before the open. We 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 did the best one, but this this one worked. That that's a that's a short. I'm gonna call this again. I, I I actually this did not break 32. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do it again. I'm 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 just happy. I'm happy and I'm in a good mood. And I'm not going to do this again, but I'll call it again for those of you that want to. And let's just go over it. Um, I was going to say something else. I forget what. I'm going to talk about this more tomorrow, but I feel the need to say this today. This is exactly what I'm talking about in reference to the conviction. Okay. It's like we can do, our, our, I'm just not going to talk about me. I want to talk about me, not we. We can do, we and me, okay, once you get to the point when you're trading, you can do impossible calls if you have conviction. Things that you do and you, you're like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just pressed the button there with that, with that stop, with that size. Like that's what I'm talking about. It's something that, that you see like in one green bar and then falls off the planet. When you have conviction, it allows you to do that. When you don't have conviction, I can't risk a penny. Okay. So if something reverse wishes, then I don't have any conviction. So then I, I don't want to risk one penny. Okay. It's the gap itself that tells you, but also the way it trains. Okay. But you've got to have conviction to do it to take the risk. This is something that experience teaches you. Okay. It's the system and then the experience and the combination of two that, that makes you good. But it's like, just like I can't give you conviction. Now, maybe sometimes when you hear me talk, you get the conviction or you get more conviction. But really, I can't give you the conviction. The knowledge should give you the conviction. But in a specific gap or trade or stock pick, you really have to have it. Okay, I can't give it to you. Just like you can't really give it to me. All right. Now the gap rating helps you get the conviction, but you might rate the gap and the gap might rate amazing and you might really like it, but then it reverse swooshes and then immediately you lose the conviction and then that's it. It's gone. It's completely gone then. It's over. 
okay? So you have to know what that feels like, and it really kind of is an individual thing because it's the combination of the knowledge, but then you still have to have the setup into the open. Now, granted, this was really... What the heck did I see that? I think it was the way it held. I think it was actually, I mean, just going back in my mind and my time here, I think it was the force of the hold. Because it wasn't a number. I think it was the force of the hold that made me do it. You knew Creeble would work today. You arrived five minutes ago and will not trade today. What was the entry in the stop? All right, we'll go over it. Wine boy, I don't know why you weren't here. Listen, this is very aggressive, but if you want to do this again, you can. 49 by 65. No, wait. Let's wait for the two minute. I'm going to call the two minute here. 45. Mm, it really should be by 70. 45 by 70 on the two. No, let's wait for the five. Don't, don't anyone take this again. Let's wait for the five minute. Let's wait for the five minute here. I'll call us again. It could break the low and go to 32. If you want to do the two minute, it's 45 by 70. Uh, but let's wait for the five minute. But 45 by 70 if you want to be aggressive here in the two minute. I I'm not taking this again. But you could get 50 cents out of this through the break of the low. This could be another two hours in here very quickly. 10 o'clock though. Let me just look at the market. It's, I, I knew this would get down. I mean, I knew it would get down. Here, you could do this in the two minute. I'm not, though. I knew this would get down, and then even though it didn't do exactly what I wanted it to do, I'm not taking this again, by the way. I, even though it didn't do exactly what I wanted it to do, I knew it would work. So I was actually prepared to be patient today. I had prepared, I was like mentally, I had to mentally prepare myself to be patient today. That's why I wrote the stuff down that I said. Like I had to, I had to like hold myself back to mentally prepare to be patient today that I didn't do anything crazy in this, knowing that it wasn't exactly what I wanted to see, but still knowing it would work, and so that I wouldn't do something crazy just because of the fact that I was wanting a good one. I didn't do anything crazy. That was just, I just saw it, so we did it, and I called it, and I just very relaxed did it. I didn't know I was going to see that, though. I had no idea I was going to see that at all. And I'm not even sure what I saw now, except for the fact that I think that I just saw the pressure on it. I think I just felt the pressure on it. I think I just realized, I think it was the pressure. I saw and felt the pressure on it. And so we did it. So the entry was in here. It was 99 by whatever number I said. I don't even remember. I just don't even remember. What did I say, 30, 35? I don't even remember where I put the stop now. I just kind of sized myself in the wind. I actually sized myself for 30 cents. So I don't know, did I say 30 or 35? I sized myself for 30 cents. I might have been a little over if it had stopped. I just made it easy for myself. And then, then it fell off the planet. It was the entry here that was the best thing about this. So no matter where you took it in here, here. Well, there was two great redeeming qualities about this. One was the first entry, and the second was when I took more of it in here. Oh, gosh, that was aggressive. And then when I saw this here and I didn't get out, I was like, oh, my Lanta. I took more of this in here, and then when I saw this in here, I was like, ah. But we did lower the stop then, and then it fell. So the, the ad here really mm, helped me. I guess that's why I didn't care that I didn't hold it all the way down here because I had so much of this. I was like, ah, and then I took it. All right, so that was Cree. Anyone have any questions about Cree? I'm not doing this again. It didn't break 32. I'm very happy with my day. I did an ad like within five minutes of taking the first trade, which is something I don't do all the time, but... Okay, wine boy. Well, try to come tomorrow. Can you come tomorrow, wine boy? We should have something good tomorrow. We'll look at the list for tonight as well. Oh, look at this. Man, this isn't done. This isn't done, and I'm not doing it again, but it's not done. Look at that. Did you see that there?
Is anyone still in it or did anyone retake it? This, this is nowhere near done, which I did say earlier, but I'm just not redoing it. Red's back in it. There's, there's nothing like conviction to trade. You have to have conviction to trade. If you don't have conviction, how can you do it? I can't. I won't. I won't. And no one is going to convince me of anything that I don't have conviction in. Not going to happen. And here this goes again. Look at this. Mm -mm -mm. Here it goes. It's going to hit on the 5 and it'll break 32. This is a nice crawl here. Here it goes. 10 o'clock. So if this was an NCOF, which it wasn't, I thought it might be over the weekend, but it wasn't. But if it was, I would have held this to the dream target. It was a decision I made. I also would have risked more than a regular risk, but I knew that it wasn't. I still did my normal thing. I had such a good entry though, but I did take more in here. All right, let's look at the market. Market's falling today. Do I know why? No. Does it matter? No. Is there anything bearish in this market? No. Is the market still going to make a new high? Yes. Is it going to do it today? No. Market is falling. There's a report at 10 and 1 at 10.30. SPY is going to pull in. It looks like break yesterday's low, which it hasn't done yet, but it's going to. Is that helping the Cree? No. Cree would have worked no matter what anyways. But Cree could really, really hit hard through 32 now with the market falling at this time of the day. I'm not back in it, though. So target for the SPY today, though, could be even 208. And I'm not saying that for surely. We could hold around 209-ish, but the market will probably close red today. The only way we don't close red today is if we fall really hard and have a bounce that must happen around lunch. And I don't, I don't see that happening. I think actually we're going to be red today. And target for the QQQs today is 107. And this thing's still going. Oh, I just saw the spread in this. This is a very whipper spreader thing. All right, let's go over the hog. Let's go over the hog. We'll just go over this here, but I do, I'm going to give a lecture tomorrow about something in reference to this, but we'll just go over it. Here, I'll tell you what. I, didn't, I wouldn't have had a problem with you doing this yesterday on the 15 minute. I would have had no problem with you doing this whatsoever. You could have done it here, and you actually could have even done it here. And that, I think that would have been absolutely fine because your target then is the low of the day, which had never broken here. Okay, so that would have been fine, and it held, and you could have done it. I don't want to take a, clock at 12, a trade at 12 o'clock in the afternoon, and I don't want to take a trade at 1.30 in the afternoon. But I will tell you, though, that I have no problem with you doing this in here by the time of the day here that this happens. I do have a problem with you doing the reverse swoosh. When you do that, you do it knowing that it has a 50% chance of failing. And so I don't think that makes sense in a bullish market to be shorting reverse swooshes. So it would have been too aggressive. You could have done it half size. If you had lost, what else would you would have done all day? Nothing. So this is what you could have done. I didn't, and I don't regret it. The afternoon trade made more sense, and you can have conviction in that, but not this because of this. And and for every one of these that you get that falls in here, that you could have made two R's. It's not like this was 17 R's for Pete's sakes. For any, every one in here you could make two R's, you'll lose on five. So then it just doesn't make any sense. It's never like a million R's. Surf Dog did it on the 15 minute. Hog was a watch New Jersey trader, but it didn't set up right. And as you know, that's really what counts here for us to make money. FYI, boom, Cree. It did have a short in it. It was a short. It was a short. It wasn't a long. It was a short. But I'm just saying the setup wasn't ideal. So you take it thinking 50-50-50-50.
I don't I don't like 50-50 odds anymore. I don't know if I ever have. But I'm definitely getting pickier. I'm more picky now than I've ever been, ever. But what if we could get to the point where we only lost once and every blue moon? Can you imagine what our R could be? We'd make more money. So it just makes sense. What I'm teaching you makes sense. And that's even not just the information, but the philosophy behind why you're supposed to think like this. You were long early, got stopped out, reversed. New Jersey trader, I don't know why you were long that. One day you'll do the class. Here, this, is anybody in this? Be careful. That had a move. It triggered on the one. It triggered on the two. It triggered on the five. It's trying to back up. Be very, 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 very careful. It did not actually break 32. Time of the day is 10.07. If you're in it, be careful. Are you talking about hog or are you talking about, what are you talking about, surf dog? Which one? Hog? You took hog at 9 a.m. before the open? Well, you people are getting nuts now on me calling these things. You people are like taking them just like, you're like, oh, she said it's going to do this. So I'm just going to take it. Woo! It's like, I, I had a friend text me last night about Facebook. Let's talk about that. I think it was Ernie's out tonight. He's like, what do you, what do you want to do with that, Melissa? I'm like, <laughs> I haven't even seen him for like months. <sighs> All right, let's look. I think this is out tonight, though. I think that's why he texted me. Yep, this is that tonight. All right. Hmm. I don't think this is going to do any thing significant tonight. This is just instinct. Could this play out and be end up being good? Yes. But actually, my instinct here, I'll have to text my friend, is that it doesn't do anything of significance. Like, don't look for this to look like Netflix. And, and, and I, this is just intuition here. I, I don't think this is going to do anything of any significance for us to get any play in. Any, 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 at all. But I could be wrong. I'll see it tonight. I'll rate it if it gaps up or down. I'll do whatever I need to do with it. But I just have a feeling here this isn't going to do anything of significance. If anything, I think it gaps down. And then I think it doesn't play out right as a short and doesn't work right as a long. I, 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 don't, I don't think this is going to do anything that ends up being right on this earnings period here for this thing here. Sorry to say. All right, let's just see what other ones. Cake is out tonight. Oh, I just don't see anything really there on that Facebook to do. Just nothing. Um, this is another wild and whippy spready one. Okay, cake is out tonight. eBay's out tonight. Oh. All right, this I like. eBay is a top watch tonight. Actually, no matter what it does. Finally, another one that looks like some potential in it. FFIV. Yeah, I like eBay. Well, I don't know what it does. I'm not going to tell you I know if I don't, but I do like it. Nothing here. Qcom. I looked at this last night.
Okay, we have two nice watches here, eBay and QCOM, that I like tonight. And, and we're going to watch the Facebook, but I'm just saying. Uh, SSCS. Let me just look at this one. Oh, hold on. You did IRBT? Tonight's watches. Well, I'll put Facebook in the mix here, but I really like eBay. Oh, 9 a.m. my time, your time. Okay. This is another watch tonight. Okay, this looks like it's bouncing here for those of you that retook it. I think it sets up again, though, no matter if it else could set up on the 15. But, you know, you're in it late. DFS just didn't have the volume, but was a short. An IRBT. I just don't do these things after they look like pieces of crap. Also, I don't think the volume in here is right in here today. I just don't think the volume is correct here, what this should look like for that. Uh, but this was a good one, too. Okay, market's falling. All right, any questions from anyone at all? So I don't know what Facebook does tonight, but I don't think it does anything significant. So don't look for that to be like Netflix, whether up or down. I do like Qcom. I do like eBay to do something tonight, meaning a good gap. Whether they're up or down, I don't know. I don't see anything tonight where I'm like 100% conviction this gap's down. I don't see that in any chart I'm looking at tonight. I don't see it like I saw it in the creek. But I will tell you that this didn't end up doing what I thought it would do in the gap, but then it did on the live day. So it was good. And we did it. Oh, this is still trying to hold in here. I think this breaks 32 today, but I don't think it's gone to 30. If I did, I'd, I'd, I'd take it again. Okay, any questions from anyone about anything at all? Nice, good day today, solid day today, fast day today, quick momentum today, great entry, everything's good. Um, just be here bright and early tomorrow morning. We'll have a lot to go over. I just looked at the stuff for tonight. I didn't even look at it anymore tomorrow morning. Let me, let me just look at tomorrow mornings quickly. Uh, but it's earnings season. Like Trader Gal said, finally, life is back to normal. We didn't get an NCOF in this today. I don't know if we'll get one tomorrow. I won't know until we get one. We will have them, though, in the next month. In May, we will get them. It's earning season. They will fall into the sky for us. But I don't know until I see them. LLY is tomorrow. Let me just look at that one. Oh, uh, new is tomorrow, too. Hold on. I'm just going to look at two things here. Oh, this is going to gap down. Mm. Okay, new. L-O-Y. This chart is so long. Huh. Well, that's why. All right, any questions? Any questions? If not, I'm going to let everybody go. Everyone should have a fabulous day. Everyone should be up. Uh, you know, if you're in this, you're in this because you think it's going to a dream target, but I'd be very tight here. It actually looks like it, somebody's trying to buy it in here. That They're not in charge of the stock on the day. It will drop again. I don't know where or what time, but this looks like somebody's trying to buy it in here. You know idiots try to buy this stuff after they have a fall like that. 
you know, into support. It's ridiculous, but there's too many tails here now on the five minute chart. It looks like somebody's trying to buy it. So I'd have the stop tight. I think it resets up in the 15 minute, probably in another two hours. Not here, not now. And I did not retake it. I'll be around today. If if I if I feel like taking any more risk, I, maybe I'll do it on the 15 minute, but I have no idea what time it would be. And I don't even know if I'm going to. And I'm not even saying that I will. And but you could do a 15 minute on this today in the afternoon. You do have the market with you, which I like to have if I'm doing something in the afternoon. You don't have the market against you today if you short. And this does have target left. Surf dog, it's tomorrow actually. Got moved. <laughs> I have no idea what we're going to get tomorrow. Life is a bowl of cherries. All right, does anyone have any questions? You're welcome, New Jersey trader. And don't keep trading all day. Jeez Louise, I just handed you a pile of gold in here. Walk away and go to the gym. <laughs> we'll get something good tomorrow, Surf Dog. And if not, listen, I'm telling you right now, if there's nothing good tomorrow, if nothing rates well, if I don't like anything to trade, I'm not taking a trade tomorrow. We just hit it out of the gate. You must do what I say. Listen to what I'm saying. We're not doing crap. I don't know what we're going to get tomorrow. And I'm not saying we don't get anything. And I'm not saying we don't get something good. But all I'm saying is if we don't, then I'm not doing anything. And if anybody whines and anyone complains, then I don't know what to tell you. Then do crap. Lose money. I'm not doing it. Okay. If I did crap, I could never have just called that thing there. That was an impossible call. That that says Melissa Armo all over it today. The call I just made in Creed take, for the entry. To see the gap, to see it would break, to see it would fall like that, to see it would do it, to see it at the number that I called it. That says Melissa Armo all over that thing. It's imprinted in the stock. I cannot do stuff like that if I would trade crap. Do you understand? The reason I'm able to do that is because I always do stuff that is good. I don't do crap, and we're not going to do crap. And I don't know if we're going to get anything good tomorrow or not, but be here bright and early, ready to go, rate your gap, gaps, and have the numbers written down, and then you know, and then you follow it. It's like I can't know until it opens. And, and, and I can be right on top of something. I can be like leaning on my keyboard to short hog. But if it opens a reverse swooshes, then I just pull back. And then I turn my platform off because it's just not good to do that. If I had every dime back that I ever lost trading days I should have never traded, I, I'd, I'd have a billion dollars. At least five million, maybe more. I could have bought an apartment like I'm living in right now, this luxurious, fabulous place, okay? I'm telling you, you got to learn. And the sooner you learn, the better. Jaguar Pasta, thank you for your calls. You're welcome. You're welcome. Yes, you attack it when it's in your favor. And I had no plans to attack us today, but just roll with me. Because sometimes I do see it in the live moment. It didn't matter, really where you took it though here. If you got it where I hit it, if you got it 10 pennies late, it fell off the planet. <laughs> All right. Have a great day, everyone. I'll see you here back in here bright and early tomorrow morning at 830. Same password for tomorrow. Have a great day. Have a good one. Do this again if you want in the 15 minute. Only risk a portion of the gain from the morning. Okay. If you do, target on this for the next target, if you do it, is through the low of the day. And it, and it could actually go to 31. And I'm not saying I have 100% conviction that's going to happen. I have to see how this acts here, where it sets up, the time it sets up, the number it sets up, where it rallies to. And I'm not saying that I'm going to do it. But I will leave it up here just in case. It's very early. When I'm saying about the possibility of redoing it, I'm saying like 1.15 in the afternoon. So you could actually go to the gym and then come back. All right. Have a good day, everyone. <laughs> All right. You're welcome.